I think everybody wants to be an individual. Everybody wants to have their own place and everybody wants their own independence. Well, with being disabled, for the most part, you're not going to make a lot of money. So you can't afford to get a house. There isn't enough affordable. 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 Affordable, accessible housing. You know, have your own place to go and just run your own life and make your own decisions. It's terrible to die having never lived. Tech Street's affordability. I get a lot of people that live on $733 a month and they're looking for housing. Unless you are in subsidized housing, you can't literally touch anything. Some of the apartments that we looked into, we had to make, I think it was two or three times the rents, which disqualified a lot of our people. Their income is limited, so they can only afford so much house. I would be afraid of putting anyone in housing even at $600. Uh, most people can't live on $133 a month. People with disabilities also face obstacles in their housing search related to credit reporting. If they have not been renting, then they may not have references. There's no accessible apartments for my consumers. There are very, very long waiting lists, sometimes years. The federal government has limited the vouchers for the housing projects. The waiting list is its embarrassingly long. The application waiting list for a voucher can be up to five years. The most important thing is to get involved locally and advocate for housing that is affordable, accessible, and integrated into the community. You have to vote with your voice in a lot of respects for this. Questions should be asked of our local government officials about what they are doing or what they can do. Because access to affordable and safe housing is absolutely essential and we believe a right for individuals in our society. When it comes together and everybody does a little bit and we accomplish it and we can sign off on it and say it's done, there's no better feeling. The Statewide Independent Living Council of Georgia logo is shown. SILCGA.org, Georgia Independent Living Network.